history of Federal Jacks and the Kennebunkport Brewing Company extends back to 1992, when it all began right here on the waterfront in world-famous Kennebunkport, Maine. The brews quickly took on a life of their own, and in order to allow for greater distribution, an expansion to Portland, Maine led to the opening of the Shipyard Brewing Company. Here at KBC, we kept on brewing small batches of our fine, handcrafted ales, some of which are still unique to Kennebunk and only available at Federal Jacks. More than 20 years later, Maintaining the integrity of Maine craftsmanship and building our beers with great passion are as important to us as it was when we first began. Our ales are brewed one batch at a time using four main ingredients, malted barley, hops, water, and yeast. Malted barley gives beer its flavor and color. Our barley comes from England for a better, more authentic English style ale. Hops give beer its bitterness and aroma. At the Kennebunkport Brewing Company, we use hops from the Pacific Northwest and England, depending on the recipe. Water is the foundation of beer, and here in Kennebunkport, Maine, our water comes from the Branch Brook Watershed, just 18 miles to our west in Sanford, Maine. The fourth main ingredient is yeast, which converts sugar from the malt into alcohol and CO2. With origins in Yorkshire, England, our yeast strain has been fermenting English-style ales for over 150 years. These are ingredients that can be found in almost every beer, but it's the way we at Kennebunkport Brewing Company combine the malted barley, hops, water, and yeast that make our ales unique. Here's how we do it. Treated water, called brewing liquor, is heated in the hot liquor back. Then we put the malted barley into a mill that cracks the grain open. Next, the malt is fed into a vessel called a mash tun, where it is mixed with the heated and treated brewing liquor from the hot liquor back. Here, the starches in the malt are converted into fermentable sugars by the enzymes which are present in the malted barley. We've now created a sweet and liquid called wort. The wort is then pumped into the brew kettle, traditionally referred to as the copper, where a fire beneath heats and boils the brew. Hops are added to the boiling wort for bitterness, and unique to our brewing system, whole flower leaf hops are steeped in our hop percolator to enhance the flavor and aroma of the finished beer. After the boil, the burners are extinguished and the wort remains in the copper for clarification by means of a whirlpool pump. Trub, comprised of malt proteins and hop solids, separates out, leaving a bright, clear wort. This and the hop tea from the percolator are then cooled via heat exchanger to 68 degrees while being transferred to the fermenting vessel. Next up, fermentation. Here, the yeast turns the sugars into alcohol. At KBC, we use the world-renowned Ringwood yeast from England. Three days later, the active fermentation process is complete. The ale will remain in the fermenter for another three days of aging. Then, the finishing touches, clarification in the conditioning tank, and cold filtration into the bright tank for brilliant clarity. We'll add CO2 for carbonation and the beer is ready to serve. The whole creation, from grain to glass, takes seven days. Now it's time to deliver the fresh ale to our customers. Here in Kennebunkport, the majority of our beer is served directly through the taps right upstairs at Federal Jacks. We also fill growlers from our serving tanks for sale next door at the Shipyard KBC store, right next to the brewery. There's no limit to the creativity and quality of our brewing lineup. Our beers are handcrafted with the spirit of tradition, integrity, and innovation. So sit back, relax, and enjoy one of our quality beers crafted right here in Kennebunkport. Join us at Federal Jacks and have a brew with a view.